Here is the first rhythm, la pompe. La pompe is the most recognizable way of comping in gypsy jazz. It is in fact just playing swing jazz rhythm, but in the unique style of Django and his fellow hot club musicians. Here it is. One, two, three, four. <laughs> A few things about playing La Pompe. Don't make the afterbeat too strong. It is true that there is a slight accent, but when you exaggerate it, it could influence your steadiness. Just practicing straight four could help you to become steady. This is what American rhythm players, like Freddie Green or El Casey, used to do. Later on, you can add a slight accent on the afterbeat. Often just thinking of that is already enough to make it swing. Two, when you practice, use a metronome from time to time. This will help you to discover whether you have the tendency to slow down or to rush. Put the metronome beat on half time and on the afterbeat. One, two, one, two, three, four. Let's look at that little upstroke. It is not strictly necessary, but it sounds very nice and recognizable, so I recommend it. Important is to not try to emphasize the upstroke. An exaggerated slow upstroke drags the tempo down and sounds like three strokes instead of two. This is the moment where you have to hit it. It's a kind of an upbeat just before the one and the three of the bar. One, two, three, four, ka one, two, ka three, four, ka one, two, ka three, four, ka one. Ka one, ka three, four, ka one, two, ka three, four. Concerning the strength of the upstroke, the opinions differ. I prefer a short one, almost played, played by chance. Much like you are going up anyhow, so why not touch the strings on the way? But I know that, for example, Fabi Lafertin prefers a larger one. That really sounds more like a pump, a bike pump. Now, about the length of the chord sound. To practice steadiness, I would say, play every chord short. But watch out not to make that, count, that sound too dry. Of course, you will recognize this one. That is possible as well, but I would say it is more suited for ballads or medium tempo tunes. You can also use this to accompany a theme and change to this when the solo starts. First this one. So 
solos. Just for a slight change of comping sound. Well, have fun playing La Pompe. Thank you.